What is up guys and welcome back to the channel. This is Dr. Hamid Snacks. So today we have a pro battle over here. And in the first corner, we have the Realme GT2 Pro, the latest and greatest for Realme. And of course, in the other corner, we have the Xiaomi 12 Pro. So like I mentioned, both of these two phones have the pro names into their models. And that means that it does have the Snapdragon 8 Gen 1 processor inside of them. And in terms of RAM, 12 gigs of RAM and 256 gigs of storage. So before we start anything, let's check out the temperature we're in. 28.7 in terms of the phones, 35.9 over here, 35.8. So pretty much the equal on both of these two phones. Let's boot up these two phones over here and see which one will come out on top. Normally, Xiaomi and Realme phones do have a very fast boot up. Let's see up against each other, which one would come out on top. Both of these two phones have been charged up to 100%, just to let you guys know. It looks like the Realme is going to be done. All right, so it is done and it's ahead of the Xiaomi 12 Pro. Let's go to the calendar. Still does take some time to load up. All right, Xiaomi 12 right behind it. Quite some time behind it, actually. Okay, looks like the Realme device is all ready to go. Whereas on the Xiaomi 12, it does take some time. Okay, so it looks like all of them are ready to go. And these are the apps that we are going to test out. And just to show you guys, all apps has been closed on both of these two phones. And also both of them are connected to the same Wi-Fi network as well. Every other form of connection is disabled on both of these two phones. And in terms of the display, both of them are maxed out in terms of the brightness. Both of them running in at HD+. And also, of course, that 120 hertz. Just because I think that's the one that a lot of people would be setting up their phone at. So these are the apps that we're going to test out in terms of the temperature. 36.2. Here as well, 36.2. So one, two, three. Let's go. Okay, so done here with the Xiaomi 12 with the GT2 Pro just right behind it. Let's move on to the next one, Pokemon Go. Okay, the GT2 Pro does take this round, just slightly edges out the Xiaomi device. YouTube. Okay, about the same. Next up, Instagram. Okay, I think about the same, but I think the Xiaomi 12. All right, another huge app of here, PUBG Mobile. Okay, GT2 Pro just slightly edges out the real Xiaomi device here, which is Really interesting. Both of them are really, really good. Okay, let's go back to this. Let's go to Google Chrome. Okay, about the same on both phones. Let's check out the temperatures. 36.3, still pretty respectable. 36.2, so pretty much the same. Let's go to Facebook. Okay, pretty much the same. Shopee. All right. Let's go to YouTube Music. Okay, just GT2 Pro. Go to the settings. Manchester United. Super disappointing season. Let's just get it over with, just like this app. Okay, GT2 Pro, Premier League. Very close indeed. Go to Netflix. Okay. Camera app. Okay, I think pretty much the same. Let's go to TikTok. Okay, let's go to Twitter. I think the GT2 Pro and the Play Store. All right, so pretty much the same on both phones. Let's check out the temperatures here. 36.6, go to the GT2 Pro. 36.4, so pretty much the same. So now let's do a RAM test. So let's go to Genshin Impact. Okay, no refreshes here. Let's go to Pokemon Go. Still very good. Let's go to PUBG Mobile. Okay, still holding up very, very well. Let's go to Facebook. 
Okay, still working really good. Let's go to Premier League. Pretty much the same. Let's go to Twitter. Also very good. And lastly, Instagram. Okay, not much refreshes on both phones, which of course is a really good thing. 12 gigs of RAM, like I mentioned. In terms of battery, you can see here, it's gone down to 97%. Still here on the GT2 Pro, 100%. Okay, and now we're going to go on to the next test. Okay, so now we're going to do a GPU test and both of these two phones are going to export this into 4K at 30 FPS and I'm of course using InShot. So one, two, three, let's go. Let's see which one will come out on top. Okay, so we're done here with the Xiaomi 12 Pro ahead of the GT2 Pro. Okay, and moving forward, we're going to do a Geekbench on both of these two phones. Temperature-wise, 37.3, so it's going to be really interesting while we do this benchmark test here, 36.5. So we're going to run this test and I'll see you guys at the end when we do get the results. Okay, so we are done. The Xiaomi 12 Pro just slightly edges out the Realme GT2 Pro, but of course the important thing are the scores. So pretty interesting here. In terms of the single core score, very, very close to each other, but the GT2 Pro just slightly edges out the Xiaomi 12. Whereas when it comes to multi-core score, over here with the Xiaomi 12 Pro, it definitely does beat the GT2 Pro. So let's go on to the compute test and let's just run this one. One, two, three, let's go. And again, I'll see you guys at the end where we do get the results. Okay, so we are done and over here again with the GT2 Pro, it definitely does beat the score here. Not a substantial amount, but still a very good score. Temperature wise, is it really hot when I'm holding it? 39.8, very amazingly hot on the Xiaomi 12 Pro. As here, 29 before. So both of these two phones are really hot when running this test. And of course, in battery wise, here it's gone down to 97%, whereas over here, 94%. So I'm just gonna cool down these two phones before we start the next test. All right, so moving forward, we're gonna do the last test. But before we do that, let's check out the cool down temperature, 36.2. Here, 36.1, so pretty much the same on both phones. So before we're gonna test out, which is the 3D Mark test, Let's see the phones over here. That's a battery wise, 94, 97. So we're gonna run this score. We're gonna run this test. And again, I'll see you guys at the end when we do get the results. Okay, so we are done. And in terms of score, really not much in it. But of course, we're gonna check out the refresh rate as well. Also very, very close to each other. So both of these two phones looking like a really solid deal. Let's go to the slingshot test on both phones. So again, I'll run this test and I'll see you guys at the end when we do get the results. Okay, so both of them done and both also maxed out. And in terms of the temperatures, it's really hot when I'm holding it. 40 degrees on the Xiaomi and with the GT2 Pro, 39.5. So quite a difference a bit over here. And in terms of the FPS, definitely the Xiaomi 12 is definitely doing better. 74 compared to 59 over here. And but in the test too, this one did better. So these are the results you wanna get. You can screenshot this, whatever you want to do. Of course, uh, it's pretty interesting on both of these two phones. And again, just a quick recap in terms of the Geekbench. This is the CPU source. And if we go on to the CPU test, let's go to the history site. These are the scores that you're gonna get. So still pretty good scores on both of these two phones. Of course, the GT2 Pro maybe just slightly edges out the Xiaomi 12 Pro. So if you guys did find this video helpful and also wanna see more of these type of videos, do click the like and smash the subscribe button down below for more videos like this in the future. Do also follow me on my social as well on Twitter, Instagram, Facebook, and YouTube at Dr. Hammerstein. So that is it. This is Dr. Hammerstein. Stay safe, take care, and wash those heads.